Hey guys, uh, just a pretty quick tutorial on how I was able to root the LG Vault 2 LS751 for Boost Mobile. So um, I wanted to actually do this and have it like root in front of your guys' eyes, but um, the first few times I attempted to root, it failed. So I thought it wasn't going to work the third time when I did it, and it actually rooted the phone. So couple things you'll need to download and um, I will upload them to my Google Drive and share the link so you guys can download them but let's go to um, file manager here real quick and I'll show you guys and so what you'll need to download is um, the King root app 4.1 you'll definitely need this one uh, this is the one that actually worked for me uh, some people say the Kingo root works, which I downloaded that one also, but that one failed like multiple times. So you want to get uh, King root 4.1. You want to install it, and uh, you also want to download and install this app called Super Su Me Pro version 7.8. So let's install it. I'm not going to actually run these apps again because I already have root but I'll explain it to you guys in this video so you'll need that and also if you want to just to double check you can download root checker so you know for sure you have um, root so once you have all those basically installed what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna open up king root okay now I already have root so it's gonna ask for super user permission so I'll grant it and hit try it. Now it's going to verify root status, and obviously, it's telling me root access is unavailable. But that's just because I have Super Su already installed. So um, from this point, before you click try root, what you're going to want to do is go through all your applications that you have, every one of these applications, and open them. Make sure that when you click uh, recent like you'll have a full Rolodex of um, applications open. Once you have that, basically you have all your applications open, then you can click the try to root. It may fail a couple of times, but just be persistent. And um, as long as you, you know, you run a lot of apps in background, then um, it will actually help push root into the phone. Similar process to the ZTE Warp Sync, similar process to the Kyocera Hydro Icon on KitKat works with this. So yeah, run a bunch of applications because if you just do it straight from here, it will fail. I've tried it and it does work after you accept the Stage Fright update, so it will root. But once you have it rooted, it's going to have the, the King User uh, root um, application to use. And that's where the Super SU... Me Pro comes in handy. Where is that app at? There it is, right there. Okay. This is where it comes in handy. So once you um, have your phone rooted, you're going to open this application and you're going to give it, you know, you're going to give it um, root access from the other. And what happens here is, you know, you just click. The little big blue button right here and it's going to remove the king user um, root permissions app and swap it with super, with super su so um, that is pretty much how you can achieve root and um, install these real quick and once you have root you'll be able to use rooted applications to help out um, some people like the King User app. I don't. I prefer using Super SU. I find Super SU to be a lot better. Anywho, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. Um, pretty straightforward. So if you guys have any questions, please leave your questions in the comment section of this video. Uh, if you have not subscribed, please do so. Click that subscribe button. I do apologize. I wasn't able to do an um, actual root video that I wanted to do that showed you guys of having the phone actually being rooted. And be very careful if you root this phone. Be super careful that you don't do anything uh, foolish because there is no recovery so there is no bouncing back if you soft brick your device 
There's no KDZ file released by LG yet, so you can use the LG Flash tool to bring it back to stock. So basically, this is pretty much like it. Like, you know, you're only shot, you root, you can de-bloat it with certain apps that you know are safe to remove. Do not mess with anything else that would get you soft brick. That's just my warning to you guys. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, I'll see you guys in another video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And you guys have a blessed week.